Okay, we're trying to find the dimensions of a rectangle, so the first thing I'm going to do is just make a little diagram of a rectangle. And I'm going to label the sides. I'm going to label this side length, and this side is going to be width. And we also know that the area of this rectangle is 63 square meters. If you look at the very first sentence, it says the length of a rectangle is 12 meters less than three times its width. Okay, so this length, L, is, that word is, is that equal sign, 12 meters less than three times its width. So 3W minus 12. Okay, and uh, we also know that the area of a rectangle is length times width. And in this case, the area is 63 square meters. So I'm just going to replace A with 63. And I'm going to replace this L with 3W minus 12. And that's length times width is equal to 63 square meters. Okay, so I'm just going to multiply this out. 63 is W times 3W, that's 3W squared. And W times a negative 12, that's minus 12W. This equation is quadratic, so what I want to do is I want to get all the terms on one side, and then I want to get a zero on the other side of the equation. So I have 3w squared minus 12w minus 63, because I subtract 63 from both sides of this equation, and the other side is going to be equal to zero. Okay, so to solve this quadratic equation, I want to factor this. Um, it's easier if you factor a 3 out of each term. And then we'll write this quadratic expression as a product of two binomials. So I'm looking for two numbers multiplied together, that's negative 21, but when you add those two numbers together, it's negative 4. So that would be a 3 and a 7. The 7 has to be minus, and the 3 has to be positive. So now I'm going to solve each of these factors for 0. So if I solve this equation, I get W is equal to negative 3, and here W is equal to 7. Now, because we're talking about dimensions of a rectangle, this solution here does not make sense for this problem. It might make sense for another problem, but not for this one because it's negative, so we're just going to throw that one out. The width of this rectangle is 7 meters. Okay, the length, well, if we look back up here at this first equation that we came up with, the length is 3 times W minus 12, so in our case it would be 3 times 7 minus 12. That's 21 minus 12. So the length of this rectangle is 9 meters. And those are the dimensions of this rectangle.